Welcome to today's five minute Bible study. We are looking at the theology of John Wesley. We've been looking at the three general rules that Wesley gave his societies that are still known today as the rules of Methodism. The first one we saw last time, quite simple, do no harm. The second rule, which we examine today, is just as simple and direct, do good. Do good. The first was sort of a negative, was it not? Avoid those things that harm people. Avoid those things that injure people. Don't do them. And then the second is the positive application. But not only do you avoid doing harm, you actively do good. You try to help people and encourage them, and in all the ways you can, do good. Wesley said it this way, by doing good, by being in every kind merciful after your power, as you have opportunity, do good of all possible sorts, and as far as possible, do it for all people. Be a good person and do good. It kind of reminds me of a passage of scripture from Acts chapter 10 where the Apostle Peter is preaching to the household of Cornelius, the Roman centurion. And as Peter begins to preach to him, he says these words. It's chapter 10, verse 37 of the book of Acts. Peter says, you know what happened throughout Judea. It began in Galilee after the baptism of John. How God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Spirit and with power. How he went around doing good and healing all who were under the power of the devil, because God was with him. We are witnesses of everything Jesus did in the country of the Jews and in Jerusalem. He went about under the power of the Holy Spirit, doing good. And so as we follow Christ and attempt to be Christ-like in our living, we seek to do good. Now, Wesley gave some examples of this. He said, do good in a physical way, help people who are hungry by giving them something to eat. Help those who are naked by giving them clothing. Visit those who are sick or in prison. He also said, do good by helping folks with their souls. Instruct them in the way of Christianity. Offer the gospel to them. Talk with them about the things of the Lord. Wesley well, said, especially be good to those who are of the household of faith. Those who are fellow believers. Try to help them in every way that you can. But Wesley said, just do good in all possible ways. Be a good person. There's another quote that is famous for John Wesley. It, it, he talks about the same thing, and, and you've probably heard it before, but let me share it again. Wesley said, Do all the good you can, by all the means you can, in all the ways you can, in all the places you can, at all the times you can, to all the people you can, as long as ever you can. Do good. So as followers of Jesus, we're not going to harm anyone. We're going to avoid that. But also we're going to actively do good as much as we possibly can in this world. We're going to be good people. And we're going to do good to people. You know, I heard a story once about a little girl who was praying, Lord, make all the bad people good. And Lord, make all the good people nice. Lord, make all the good people nice. We're supposed to be nice people. We're supposed to do good for folks. And that was Wesley's second rule. But Joe, when you talk about doing good to people, you also remember to do good for yourself. Treat yourself in a good way. Take care of yourself. Yeah, you know, I've known some folks who work so hard that they don't really take care of themselves. They don't get enough sleep. They don't take care of their bodies. They don't take care of their health. And they kind of wear themselves out. Wesley would say, if you're going to do good, yes, you do good for others, but also... Do good for yourself. Take care of yourself. Be good to everyone. So this is the second rule of Methodism. And let me read that quote once again. I love it so. Wesley said, Do all the good you can, by all the means you can, in all the ways you can, to all, in all the places you can, at all the times you can, to all the people you can, as long as ever you can. Let us be a people who do good. This is the follow the way of Jesus. And of course, Wesley said this is the second rule in his way of discipleship. So we've looked at the first two rules. Do no harm and do good. In our next session, we'll look at his third rule, 
stay in love with God. That'll be for tomorrow. You have a great day today, and I'll see you next time for our five-minute Bible study in the theology of John Wesley.